Hi there. Today everyone is excited because Reena ma'am has arranged a chemistry fun fair and quiz competition in the class. After entering the class, Reena ma'am asks students, "Do you know why we have arranged the science fair today? Is this some special date?" Students are confused and don't know the answer. Finally, Reena ma'am gives away the answer. Today is mole day, the most celebrated day in chemistry. But can you guess why today is the mole day? Suraj gets the hint and says, "Today is October 23rd and one mole is 6.022 into 10 raised to 23." Ma'am replies, "Correct. Mole day is celebrated from 6:22 a.m. to 6:22 p.m." on October 23rd of every year Reena ma'am asks but can you tell what this mole concept is Sachin is ready with the answer According to the mole concept the mass of one mole of a substance is equal to the numerical value of its molecular mass in grams and one mole of a substance represents 6.022 into 10 raised to 23 molecules This number is also called Avogadro's number. Perfect. But do you know how this number was discovered? Did Avogadro discover it? Reena ma'am continued, "Well, no. It was not discovered by Avogadro, but named after him due to his great contribution to chemistry. Millikan and Faraday's experiments gave one of the most accurate numbers." Faraday had conducted an electrolysis experiment and calculated the charge on one mole of electrons. Neha got curious and asked, "But how did they find it?" Reena ma'am replied, "By doing a simple experiment. He dipped two copper rods in the solution of copper sulfate and passed a current through it. Due to the current, copper on one side carried the charge to another side to complete the circuit." In this way copper on one side was reduced and on the other side it increased for every two electrons one copper was deposited on the rod simply speaking one mole of copper weighing 63.5 grams deposited on the rod two moles of electrons were used for it and the charge needed for passing the two moles of electrons was calculated from the current and duration of the current Doing simple calculations Faraday found the charge on 1 mole of electrons After a few years another scientist Millikan conducted an oil drop experiment in which the charge on a single electron was calculated and finally the Avogadro's number or mole constant was found by dividing the charge on 1 mole by the charge on 1 electron Later More experiments were done to find a more precise number. And this is how Avogadro's number was found even without counting the atoms. After hearing about the mole day, students were even more excited to participate in the fun fair. That's all for today. See you next time.